So I, instead of, because what used to happen was, say a counsellor or an NLP person would, t would ask you how you, would you like to behave instead. But if you knew how you'd like to behave, you'd just do it, wouldn't you? Mm -hmm. So this is just letting your unconscious mind do it for you. So it's an easier way to do it. So you're giving more responsibility to your unconscious mind, which will then judge the behaviours. So you'll respond differently. So this is designed to change your state. If your state, breathing affects your physiology. Your physiology affects your state. Your state affects your performance and behaviour. Yeah? So that's what we're going to do with this game. That's what it's designed to do. So imagine that timing is here now. Yeah? In the scenario that bothering you in your mind. Yeah? So imagine what he's doing. Imagine who's around him. Imagine his, look at his physiology. Look at his breathing. So look at the way he's standing. So as you're doing that, because what I want you to separate is that we're observers now, we're just watching Simon. If you're not Simon, you're watching Simon in the third person. So if you just stand in this position, because it's more of an observer position. So sit your hand like this. That's what I'm doing. Copy my physiology. Oh, right. Yeah, copy, oh, yeah, oh. yeah, yeah. So imagine Simon's, whatever Simon's doing. When I say you're going to step into Simon's body, and actually then you're going to be Simon. As if you're looking through your own eyes. Step into Simon's body. Oh, physically. Yeah, yeah, just move it to actually stand there and sort of like in that. that position. Yeah, where he was. To so see, close your eyes. See what he saw. He was here. And really feel the feelings of being in that situation. Stop and shake off. Shake off. Whose drinks that? Mine. That one. That's mine. Well. Okay, cool. Was that part of the test? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Right, Simon. So, the alphabet game. So, what we're going to do is condition one. Let me just remind you, condition one. Yeah, I've got it. Yeah. So, okay. Let us start. Okay, so off you go then. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O. P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y. A, if you can, A. Oh, yeah. A, B, C, D, E, F, G. H I J K L M N O P Q R S T U V W Y yeah, Condition two <coughs> Right Condition two Keep Which is keep going. A, That's it. B, C, 
D, E, F, G, H, I, I, J, K, L, M, N. God, this is hard. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Uh, o, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y. <laughs> P Q R so keep going, keep going. R S T U V W X Sick. Y So good, keep going, hey. Yeah. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q.
Got through that scenario. Just go back to it, imagine it. See what's around you. Be in a situation. See what you saw, hear what you heard, and really feel the feelings. Be in that scenario. I don't feel anything. Okay, just get a picture, get a picture. Or yeah, I can see it. I just don't feel anything about it. Okay, good. as if it's become irrelevant. <laughs> How wild is that? It's always supposed to be. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I need the gym now, actually. <laughs> stuff to that. Look at that, it's really weird. Feel good? Yeah. Welcome to the new code games. The new way to do things. Any issues you have, you just play a game and you get goes. Okay, it's just like, there's nothing, you know, there's... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you did that well, you good, had good rhythm there. It's it was really good. Ellis, I'll tell you what, you know, they say to play the drums, you've got to, mm. this is one of those games that would be brilliant. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, because it is so, when you, it's so easy to do that, mm. you just mm. automatically think yeah. to do it. Yeah. So that was an example of a, yeah, an alphabet game. So it will just, that, that state now, so when you went to here, that state took over the other state. Yeah. So it's not going to say. No, it's not an issue, it's nothing. Yeah. yeah. And that's that's what happens. Yeah. So and this it. is what called alpha. This is this be, this game's called the alphabet game. Yeah. So there's more of these these games. I've got a lot more. I'm busy designing a few myself. This isn't designed by me. This is um. This, this is one that's from yeah. an NLP Academy game. So this is learned from there. Um. But next time we'll play one of my ones. So there's a few more to come. So. Yeah, but that's an example of a new code game. Rather than me talking to you. So, can I get a copy of this uh, every now and again? I can you can put it in your office, yeah, as I said, I'll send you what, you can have it and, that, and then you can put it in your office and if you want to do it yourself, if someone's bothering you, just play the game. And it'll sort it out. Yeah, it'll change your state. No, that, I've said, that's, that's impressive, yeah. That's yeah. right, impressive. <laughs> hmm. Very so good. That's a new code game. Okay. Right, yeah. Cool. We've done that.